I'm Dan Tallahassee, and this is my story. You have a paintbrush. You have a camera. And you also have snow. What's in common about all of these things? They're all the tools. Growing up as a little youngster, I played in the snow every single year. I think I have a special spiritual connection to the snow stuff, the iciness, because I just find it so beautiful and fun. And I think that's the inspiration I had for making the snowball paper. So as you can see, this is the amazing thing that I've spent all these years creating. It's a masterpiece, if I do say so myself. It took me six years to make all of these snowballs. There's 55 in total. I'm really proud of them. Yes, I do consider myself an artist. I think I dedicate a lot of time, energy, thought, blood, sweat, and tears to make this amazing creation that I've spent all these years on. So I think it's safe to say that I'm an artist. No, I don't think I wasted any of that time. Um, it, I think for every moment I was creating those snowballs, that I was helping the earth. It's better than curing cancer. It's better than donating to charity. I'm making a beautiful masterpiece that I can show off to all my friends to prove how cooler I am than they are. Every second I spend on those snowballs was meaningful to me. When I put the last snowball on top of the pyramid, I thought to myself, what do I do next? But then I realized I can continue. I can make it bigger and bigger and bigger till I beat those Egyptians. Because one day my pyramid of snowballs will be the world's greatest attraction. You'll see. You might think I'm stupid now, but you'll see there, buddy. You'll see. You know, I really do think it's an amazing thing that I've done here. It's taken me so long, but now that I've finally made this wonderful masterpiece, I can finally die a peaceful death. Hopefully in a few years, of course, but you know, it's really beautiful how snow can make it amazing. Hey, kid, can you please watch? Kid, kid, what are you doing? No, that's my snow! Hey, stop! That kid, he may have been a jerk. He might have ruined my life's work. But that rapscallion, he taught me a valuable lesson.